I'm Derek Ray in position to bring you live match commentary and my expert analyst as always on these occasions is Stuart Robson and it's all about action from the Premier League in this case it's Brentford and they face Nottingham Forest well Derek when looking forward to this game you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch particularly in those central areas whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game now will the cross work out for them and a goal they start as they mean to continue they make the opening statement Well, here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease. And it's just a change of pace. And it's a comfortable finish in the end, which is made to look so easy. It's a lovely goal. So underway again here. One nil the score. Abonigi. And the challenge halts them in their tracks. He's enjoying space. He has time to play it over. No real challenge for the goalkeeper. Tremendous intuition to win it back. Moving forward effectively. It's there for him. And a goal! There he is at the double. They just can't subdue him. Well, as you can see, his movement is really good, which then makes the finish look easy. That's a decent goal, that's for sure. Back underway with the lead standing at 2 0. Ryan Yates and a tidy challenge. It's looking promising. He must finish. Oh, a save right out of the top drawer. Superstop. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Aurier. Ryan Yates. Mbermo. And a timely intervention. He continues his run. And a decent delivery. No nonsense clearance. Showing teamwork and commitment. Oh, what an opportunity. Oh, and it goes. Now he has his hat trick. A special moment for him. Well, just look at the defending here. The keeper is left totally exposed. It's an easy goal in the end, but well taken. You've got to say, an incredible first-half performance. That scoreline tells you all you need to know. And this situation could be dangerous. Not a huge chunk of added time. One minute. And there it is, the half-time whistle.
So the two teams have switched around and the second half is underway. Coming onto the pitch, number 39, Chris Wood. Committed challenge. Is it going to be? Able to clear the danger, at least for now. Oh, he's given the ball away. And he's broken free. And a foul in the opinion of the referee. Now, what can they do from this free kick situation? Well, they are committed to making the substitution here. Number 11, Jesse Lingard. Well, I think he'll be a bit cross with himself based on that free kick. Not the execution he was looking for. Thirty minutes to go then. Good technique displayed. And let's give credit to the defending. Ivan Tony. Speculative ball fired to the near post. And a goalkeeper in great form. And he's just pulled off an absolutely stunning save there. That is brilliant. This has been a top-class display today. Just look how many chances they've created. And if they want to, they could score a hatful of goals here. He's going forward well here. And the snuffing out of the cross there. Can the owner of the red convertible registration SMUG1 please return to your vehicle immediately? 15 minutes left for play. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Aboniyi. to take it away it should be and foiled only by the crossbar and up for grabs off the keeper and thumped away well not the pass he had in mind Oh, beating his opponent with ease. Well, it might still work out for them. And there goes the final whistle. And the home fans are going to be happy about this outcome. You're absolutely right, Derek. Their attacking play was excellent. Full of energy and pace. And the midfield completely dominated the game. It was a great all-round performance.